you're having a nice day. So I'm here to talk you through the new Poppy and Jazz patterns. I know we don't have a Poppy and Jazz YouTube channel yet, um, but so this is where I thought it'd be good to talk about it so I could tell you guys some more um, about them and show you them in more detail. So we've got two unisex patterns that we've brought out. These are the Pomet Granite PJs and then we've got the Walnut Duffel as well. So let's start with the PJs. So I wanted to do a really lovely classic pyjama just because I find it really difficult to find these for Jasmine um, and as you know Poppy and Jazz is named after Jasmine um, and I, I've kind of designed all of the Poppy and Jazz patterns thinking about what I like to dress Jasmine in, what's practical, what's simple and what's cute and at Christmas time you can sometimes find yourself some easy classic pyjamas like this but there is really very few to be able to buy. But also, as we're all sewers, how nice is it to be able to make these? And especially at the moment, because it's Christmas coming up, what a lovely Christmas present. Or maybe you just want to make your little one something for Christmas Day to wear or Christmas Eve. They really are, um, just like a classic adult pattern. They've got a little collar that comes into the lapel. You've got a little pocket there for them. Um, and then there's a, a button up front and then just classic little sleeves that are inset in the round um, and that's basically the top and then the bottoms are just elasticated um, with a little channel that's created at the top and then the elastic's threaded through. Super simple, very cute and the opportunity to make them in some lovely fabrics for Christmas. You could go with brushed cotton, you could go with standard cotton, cotton lawn, all sorts of options. Um, for your little ones. So I'm very excited about Jazzy wearing this particular set on Christmas Day. Then the other pattern is the walnut duffel coat and this is based on the very the exact same design of duffel coat that my mum had bought for me back when I was little and Jasmine wore it when she was two and then I thought this is such a special little duffel coat let's make a pattern from it. So this is at, it's a classic duffel. You have got patch pockets, but they're actually stitched into the inseam there, which makes it really quite nifty and obviously gives you a bit more room because they're narrow. You can have quite a sizable pocket there for them. Uh, there is a hood to keep the rain away and keep them warm and toasty. And the hood you'll see is lined. Let's open it out so you can see in more detail. There we go. So fully lined here. You can go with a really nice jazzy lining if you prefer um, and uh, there's also a bias bound along here just to keep that edge there. Now you could go ahead and just bind your seams and not line it, you don't need to line it but if you want to and obviously with children's wear it's always an opportunity to get away with some fun fabric in the lining then um, you can. And then we've got just simple duffel uh, fastening that is created with some piping or rope cord and then your duffel buttons. Very, very cute. I'll pop in some photos so you can see Jazzy in this and how fabulous she looks in it. Um, and also Jazzy and Ezra, our lovely other little model for our PJs. But I hope you can see that they're super, super cute. Um, for the walnut duffel, you want to make sure you're making it out of a wool. Something like a Melton wool would be perfect. This is like a Melton wool we've got here. Um, probably want to stay away from super thick fabrics because it's going to make it very tricky to sew them if they're really too bulky because you've got small armholes and things like that. Yeah. Uh, so guys, the patterns come from 18 months to six years. We decided not to do them for the tiddly sizes because we know that tiddly babies are not wearing duffel coats and standard pyjamas. And don't uh, forget to share them guys with the hashtags if you're popping them up on Instagram so we can all be inspired by your mate pomegranate PJs or hashtag uh, walnut duffel and then we can all see what you're making. Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to subscribe and like and I'll see you very soon. Bye.